In Webflow, you can add SVGs in two ways. The first being dragging from your desktop and placing it into your canvas, and you have your SVG as a flattened image. A second way to do this is by copying your SVG code from something like Figma. Right click, copy, and I'm gonna delete this image. And now I can add an embed component and paste in that code. Save and close, and there it is. And it's also a flattened image. But what if you wanna play around with each and every path, each and every shape inside of your SVG? Well, inside of Webflow by itself, natively, you cannot do that. And this is where SVG import comes in, all right? So SVG import is a Webflow app created by Tim from Flowcraft, right? So I'm gonna launch this. What you can do is copy your SVG from Figma. And so that copies that SVG code that you just saw. Then I'm gonna click on an element, click inside of the app, and I'm gonna turn these off right here and then paste my code. And just like that, I can now select every single path in this logo. And if I need to change something, I can by going to the settings and you can see right here, there's a fill and I can change this to a different color like black or yellow. And there you go, it's been changed. If you wanna play with it, around with it even more, you can let me delete this SVG and use the fill uh, color as a uh, current. So I'm gonna launch it paste in my code. And now this is using current color for all the fills and all the strokes. And so if I change the text color of this section, watch what happens. Gives you more access to play around with your SVGs, even playing it playing around with it on hover. And so if I click out and press the Preview, there we go. So yeah, that's SVG Import by Tim of Flowcraft. Let me know what you think about this app in the comments below or upvote it and leave comments over at wfapps.com.